Well, okay, is Libra incredible? And I got so much swizzag. You already know what's happening, Game Face Studios. I'm on here with a Madden 25 gameplay. If you guys haven't been following me or you didn't know that I am doing a Madden Connected Career running back for the Green Bay Packers, and this is him as we tool up to take on. Anyway, to start the game, they got me start running back anyway. So let's see what we can get. We up seven nothing already. Uh, Aaron Rodgers with the keeper. Oh, and I get the nice little block right there. Why didn't he slide? What was he thinking about? <laughs> what are you thinking about, A Rod? Come on, we come out of the full house. Let me get that. Oh, I should have caught that. That was me. Why right there, cuz? That was me right here. Oh, and then I'm. Oh my goodness, yo. I feel like my fucking offensive line sucks, man. Like, fucking block somebody. Every time they block somebody, they always bump him into me, and I end up running into him and shit, man. What the hell? I can't stand that, man. But, um, I'm not sure what this play is. I just ran up. Just running it. Uh, I wasn't even supposed to go that way. Touchdown. Good looking. Hey, yo, uh, <laughs> kind of, a funny thing kind of happened to me. Uh, I made my guy. My guy's actually darkening this. I'm actually right now trying to get my uh, my game face thing together. You know what I mean? Uh, it keeps making my guy red, even though I, like, I'm like i way darkening. I don't even know why he's red, you know what I mean? Um, so right now, I'm basically just doing kickoff duties. Um, as you're going to see right here, it's just another kickoff. And um, I'm going to run this out of the end zone, no doubt. No doubt about it. No doubt in my mind I'm coming out. And uh, I get rocked. Damn. That boy hit me. <laughs> but um, that was my last play of that game. It's over. We ended up with the win. For this preseason matchup between the Seahawks and the Packers. Hello friends, Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. Just prior to kickoff for this primetime extravaganza and this adds another whole layer of excitement when you have this game under the lights. Yeah, it makes it more exciting for the fans. It builds up their enthusiasm because they're out there uh, tailgating all day, getting ready for the game, but also for the players. They lay around no matter what you do during the day, all you can think about is the game. How's it gonna work out for us? So I think we're gonna see a lot of excitement because of that. Pleased to bring in the third member of our broadcast team, Danielle Bellini, with the report from the sidelines. 
Thanks, guys. In speaking with the players this week, they actually talked about coming closer together for today's game. They recognize this crowd is one of the loudest and the rowdiest in the NFL, so they feel like with that added element in play, they need to rely on each other even more so this week. Guys, we'll see if that shows up on the field today. All right, um, this is my second game. Yeah, you know I mean, we're going against the Seahawks. Listen, I can't stand the Seahawks. You know what I'm saying? After that BS last year, it wasn't their fault. It was the, you know, replacement refs last year. But as I got the demo, yo, I lost to the Seahawks about like, I should have won two of the games. I lost like four games. I don't even know how I missed that pass right there. Oh, well, I missed that catch, actually. But I'm on punt return right here. I'm saying preseason, they got you doing all kind of stuff. I was going to actually bring it out, but I couldn't track it down right. But, um, yeah, the Seahawks is like my nemesis, man. This is like a rivalry. You know what I'm saying? Um, I haven't beat them yet, yo. And and this game right here is just crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy game. I, don't know, I remember, like, the one game we had with them on, on a demo was just... I had, like, some good games um, against them on a the demo. He got rock right there. Jesus. Oh my goodness, one for five, eh, right? Come on, man. Yep, still seven nothing. One forty-two. No, that's one forty-eight. Forty-five. As I feel this punt, nowhere, nothing. Damn, if I wasn't playing around and um stayed on the turbo, I probably could have got to midfield as we get the run and I try to get away from Earl. This is name Earl Thomas. I think that guy's name Earl Thomas. I can't remember what the fuck his name is. Ian? No, his name is Earl Thomas. As I get the block for Jermichael Finley to pick up that first down. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully this year. Man, yo, if my, I hope my team don't play nothing like how they play on the video game. Because, yo, we shot. We shot on the video game, man. This this year, we shot. I, I still got to get online. I haven't got online yet. Um, When, when lose or draw, I'm going to get online and, you know, run with my squad. I'm not going to run with no other squad. But... Uh, as far as me going against, uh, let me see, the Redskins and the 49ers, I won't do it. I, you guys will not catch me with no gameplays against them guys unless they get the computer, man, because I can't deal with the running. Even the Seahawks, I can't deal with people running like that. The Seahawks look like they got a solid team. Like, I, I'm anxious to see what they're going to do this season, this year. You know what I mean? Russell Wilson in his second year. Like, I, I'm anxious to see what they do because on a video game, the guys is, they're nasty on a video game. Jesus. As, um, I don't know who that was. It just rocked me on a kickoff return. It's another kickoff return. Like, yo, they just keep scoring. Like, my, it's just like my team defense cannot stop these guys from scoring, man. Like, this is like, what, my third? This is my third punt return, man. I mean, my third kickoff return. And there's another kickoff return. I mean, we stopping them from getting touchdowns. They getting field goals, but still like oh as i get a nice little run yo i don't even think it should have been a call on that it looked like he blocked them on the side i like i'm look now uh, as i'm looking at the you know looking at it after it happened i think that he hit him on the side a little bit hmm. i don't know but let's get a clipping call oh my goodness 16 nothing in the dirt in the third quarter nothing but my backup my bench people playing, man. You know we ain't coming back. As they score again. <laughs> I'll go back for another kick return. Yo, it's crazy, man. Oh, man. Damn. Jordy Nelson blocked him right into me, man. Right into me. But I, I don't know. If, I don't know if I'm going to do a connected uh, owner mode. I thought about it. I don't know if I should do that or not. I don't, I'm not too sure because um, by the time I finish my regular career with my running back, I think GTA 5 is going to be out, and I don't want to get stuck doing anything, you know what I mean? But um, we lose this game. We didn't even get on the scoreboard. I think it was 30 to nothing, but uh, stick around for the next game. Kansas City for this preseason matchup between the Packers and the Chiefs.
Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. Just prior to kickoff for this primetime extravaganza, and this adds another whole layer of excitement when you have this game under the lights. Yeah, it makes it more exciting for the fans. It builds up their enthusiasm because they're out there uh, tailgating all day, getting ready for the game, but also for the players. They lay around no matter what you do during the day. All you can think about is the game. How's it going to work out for us? So I think we're going to see a lot of excitement because of that. Let's check in down on the sidelines with Danielle Bellini. Guys, I got a chance to speak with Alex Smith this week. And guys, he's going up against one of the best in the NFL at his position, and he knows it. However, he tells me he's not going to put more pressure on himself today. He's just focused on trying to lead his offense because he can't control the other side of the field. Guys. Thanks, Danielle. And now we'll go to the field. All right. Kicking off against the Chiefs. I'm like, yo, get out the way, Kyle. Let me get that. He didn't want to get out the way. And he ended up fumbling the ball. <laughs> he ended up fumbling and giving him a fucking six, yo. A fumble six, man. I almost said a pick six, but I'm like, yo, that's a crazy way to start the game off, man. Crazy way. I'm supposed to be doing that, not him. Why is he back there? You know what I'm saying? So, we started to play. Uh, this is our first play from scrimmage. Uh, and I get him. Oh, nice little run. Nothing. Nothing major. Six yards. You know what I'm saying? Got to start it off positive somewhat. I don't even know what playbook we running, man. But Aaron Rodgers, you know. What the hell is Jordy Nelson doing? Yo, the computer does a lot of that. Like, juking. Like, extra juking. Like, why are you extra juking, man? As I get hit in the backfield. This dude, Derek Johnson, is is everywhere. I think he's about to tackle me again right here. No, that wasn't him right here. But I didn't have nowhere to run, man. My offensive line is shot. Look at this. Shot from a cannon. Eric Barry just hit me in the backfield. Like, but that play right there, I knew he was coming. I should have just I should have just flipped the play around as I catch the pass right here for the first down. 12 yard reception. You know what I'm saying? Running nowhere. I'm where I'm running to. Nowhere. It's shot, man. We need some help, boy. Damn. The offensive line looking a little shaky right there, Lee Bro. As I get set to return the kick we down 13 nothing oh nice tackle right there the story of our preseason man can't stop nobody ain't scoring but it, it'd be a different it'd be different once we get the uh once we get into a full regular season game i'm in there every down you know because i'm gonna be every down back here's my last play of the game of this game anyway uh Oh, hit the hole and they get a, oh, get off me. Let's go. Ah, oh, damn. That, that for nothing. There's a flag on the play, man. It seems like every time I get a good run, there's a flag on the play, man. 22 to 10, dog. That shit crazy. Let me see. Let me, you take away uh seven. They really would have like 15, 15, 10 if it wasn't for Randall Cobb fumbling that ball. But, hey, ain't no excuses. He fumbled. You know what I'm saying? We lost. Um. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. Follow uh, G GFS on Twitter too. And I'm out.